Jamie just asked why I was clapping in the video, and that's to spike the audio so Andrew can perfectly sync it in editing. Why do you keep clapping like that? Because if you clap like that, it spikes the audio on all of four of these, and you're able to perfectly sync it. It's not clap on, clap off. <laughs> Folks, today I'm trying to convince I'm not really trying to convince, showing my wife full self-driving. I figured Jeeb's wife is trending on Google. Why not put her in a video and go from there? So, so I'm gonna show you the settings that we have right now for full self-driving. So full self-driving supervised. What do you wanna do? Chill, average, or assertive for? Ooh, I wanna stick with average. Average, I like that. Lane change notifications, a little chime to let you know, hey, we're going. You can also vibe out. I was going to say, can we do both? I want both. All right, minimal lane changes for current drive. Do you want minimal or? No, let it let, him let it rip. Okay. Automatics, we'll, we'll leave that. Summon beta. Okay. I think we've kind of covered the, oh, green light traffic, John. Why was that not on for you? I don't know. Okay. Well, anyways, now that we show you the settings that we got here. So this is 12.3.3 .3, full self-driving, but we don't have, because this car has ultrasonic sensors in the front, we don't have the newest auto park feature. A lot of you mentioned that in the previous video. So that's the older auto park, but it still has summon and the full self-driving is .3.3.3. .3. So does this not park? It does park, but you ha it, you only, it only lets you choose the spot it picks, whereas in the new one, without the ultrasonic sensors, it lets you pick multiple spots. So it's a little different. Huh. Yeah, honestly, I don't think it matters, but everyone in the comments like, this is not, this is, this is incorrect. All right, so let's type in, where are we going? You have nowhere to go, right? I got nowhere. You shopped at Sephora. I We're, did. Are we rouge for the year? We're, no, I can, we can go spend, drop more if you I'd want to I'd, our status. I'd rather there. spend $12,000 on full self-driving. All right, where are we going? Barnes and Noble? I could go to Barnes & Noble. I've spent more on books than I have on makeup. I know, I know. Right. What are you thinking? What time does Costco open? Is that 10 or is it nine? Let's just go. Well, you know what we should go to? What? I want to, what time does Old Navy open? Get more of those t-shirts. All right, we'll go to Old Navy, but right. this is right by it's it. It's right by it. Yeah. Although, let's let it, take, let's let it take us to Old Navy. Okay, okay. When's that open? Probably 10. All right, so we're going to Barnes & Noble. That's probably also closed till 10. <laughs> All right, let's just let's go, go to, to Target. Let's go to Target. It's right oh by Old God. Navy. It's right by Old Navy. That's definitely open. All right. Tiger Woods is doing his master's interview, and we're going to Old Navy. But happy to be here with my wife. <laughs> it's got to work. Someone's got to I know. Someone does have to pay the bills. All right. Well, uh, so here's what I need you to do. I need you to just double tap on the dun-dang, ding, ding, oh, ding, okay. ding, ding, ding. Foot. There we go. Uh, and now do it again. Uh, foot on the brake, do it again. This thing sucks. Oh my god, okay, I just don't do anything. Yeah, curb right here. Okay, if this curbs it, not my fault, right? Correct, it's not your fault. Okay. Supervise, and I'm the supervisor. Okay. Okay? Ah, uh, but what if it curbs it and you're not in the car? Are you gonna believe me? Mm, we'll go back to the cameras for Is that. Is it gonna know that there's cars coming? Yes. No, it just kind of guesses based on an algorithm. All right, so it'll do a stop here where it needs to, and then we'll creep. Wow, I don't like this. Yeah. Okay. Neither does the media. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there we go. And also, just so you know, our infant's in the back. We're really- We're really uh, putting our faith in Elon. Yeah. In, he he in created Elon this himself trust. on a TI-87. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But that was solid, straight across the three lanes. I don't lanes. break or anything. No, you do nothing. You just sit here. You do have to, uh, you know, just every once in a while it'll say to like to touch the wheel, but oh, okay. this uh, camera here is I don't monitoring. Just sit here, it was, like petrified. You can pray. I also show you guys, a lot of people have reached out about what car seat we're using. So I'll show you the one that we're using in the back that I think is pretty solid. Which, what's it called? I'll have it linked it's in the description. Up a baby. Up a baby. I'll have it linked in the description if you guys don't want to wait for that. But it's nice because it clicks into the base and then you just click it out and you can take your baby into the grocery store. It just <laughs> makes it really easy. What? Most car seats do that. Really? Yeah. I thought that was a special feature. <laughs> no. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. It's not the Duna. That one turns oh, the into The Duna's it. garbage. You look like a dummy. Yeah. They have a new one now that uh, is for taller people. All right, so just let her rip. I know, it was yelling at me. Okay, okay, good, good, good. 
I'm sweating. <laughs> so <laughs> this is so can scary. you imagine paying twelve thousand dollars for this? Uh, yeah. Really? Uh, okay, I'm, so, but let, I used no, I'm to not drive a lot to mm -hmm. go to school every day mm. and if it had just driven for me i would have done a lot of illegal things mostly like reading which is not reading and driving that's frowned upon that is frowned upon um, wow yeah you... i hate but i hate driving so for something else to drive for me yeah so how does this handle in an emergency situation it just handles it. Like Do if there's you, a, something crazy happens. Yeah, yeah. It just handles it. Because like I guess. one time I was going here and someone cut me off. Like I was trying to turn and someone cut me off on this exit going yeah. straight. They were that way. It would just it would just handle it. it I don't know. I'm not it. a mathematician. But right. It uh, it would just handle. It doesn't it. doesn't just like abort mission. And say, no, no, no. Say own. oh good luck. Yeah. yeah. Uh, no, it'll it'll handle it for you. But that's interesting. So and someone commented and said this is like a a, sh a twelve thousand dollar chauffeur. And yeah. That's cheap. I, yeah, that is cheap. I, I just, you know, a chauffeur is going to bring me a cold water, have Sour Patch Kids in the back. It's going to have things for me, right? No. This is not. No, your chauffeur, after some time, he'd be like... With all your experience with chauffeurs. Right, yeah. Cause, and I've had many. And, uh, you know, because when I go to events, I'm like, look, I have 160,000 subscribers. Please clear the room. I, I mean, this is kind of like an Uber, I guess. Except you don't have to deal with someone. But you can't take to, it home drunk, probably. Well, you could. I mean. Well, it's, you it, know. No, you shouldn't. No, obviously, you should never do that. Regardless of what I say, though, people are going to do that. They are. They and absolutely are. If you had this, it would be safer, I think, than you driving. I mean, I have. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, people drive drunk anyway without. That's what I'm driving, saying. So I guess. Yeah. You're not. No, I'm not gonna be the PSA guy that makes a difference. I mean, right. I, you right. shouldn't. I don't drink and drive. Right. I'll be that person. Okay, there you go. Maybe it'll help. Can be like Nancy Reagan. Say no to drugs, right? Well, that didn't work. Didn't. It's done. Drugs. All right, so you got to touch the wheel here. Oh. All right, so thoughts so far? Uh, I feel more, con like, at first, it's scary. I think it's because I've done, like, the no hands on the freeway before. Right, this is normal. I feel okay, but it's, like, on the side roads and stuff. It's freaky. Yeah. Yeah, definitely freaky. Impressed? Also, I would already be over in this lane, so... Yeah, R1S. So are you impressed with this, or what I you... am, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, it's doing everything. Yeah. Like, when we first got the car and, like, tested... Okay, that's a little dramatic. It's a little dramatic here. Um, when we first got it and, like, tested out the full self-driving, all it could do was change lanes on the freeway. And yeah. I was like, well, that's stupid yeah uh why do they call it full self-driving so now it makes sense mm. like i thought this was what it was gonna be from the get-go so now they're meeting our expectations okay so these meet this meets your expectations of what full self-driving is yeah it gets me from point a to point b without with without, very little to no to, intervention yeah 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 and for someone that doesn't like driving this helps you kinda, a lot kind of nice yeah and you could buy a used tesla this is a 2020 you yeah could buy a used tesla for 20 to 30 grand yeah pay 12 uh, grand for this driving. yeah i mean if you have a long commute easily worth it mm. yeah this is a tight turn here help out i said that miata just went a thousand miles an hour around the turn well they're low to the ground they are that's probably one of the most fun cars to drive fun most fun car i've ever driven oh it's telling me to touch yeah it'll touch the wheel and again people say like oh my my tesla did this or the full self-driving did this and but it's super like you're in control of the vehicle still. It, it is your like responsibility to, you know, make sure you're not on your phone, whatever. Okay. We're coming into Tarjay. Guys, spraying the weeds outside of Old Navy. Should we have them come to our house next? Yeah. A little weed issue. Why oh, do you think they're uh, driving I don't their like, car? I don't like weed. All right, so basically what it does, not basically, what it does <clears throat> is drop you off right here in front of the store. Trip complete. Oh, is this where everyone complains because it doesn't park us? Uh, yeah, yeah, they're always looking for something to complain about. Okay, so now go go into here, and we're gonna do... Um, Why is it yelling at me? 
Oh. I don't know. It's just, it's always angry. Oh. No, just don't shift the car. Well, why? Jesus. <laughs> no, I was, I was trying to turn off so I'll try. All right. Now we're going to park it. Okay. So slow down. Oh, oh, the cars. I was like, yes, yeah. I know how to park. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. So here we go. And shift to reverse. So again, foot on brake <laughs> and start. Wow, this is a game changer. You like this? Can it? Well, I because I can't back into spots. You back into superchargers. Uh, when was the last time I've ever been to a supercharger? It's been a while. It's yeah. probably our road trip. And usually I'm petrified to do it. Yeah, it's just all about confidence. I know, but like but it's, backing it's about, into like our garage. I bet you did it. I know, but I'm not good at it. Wow. I like this. You like this? Yeah. Yeah. This is actually interesting because you're seeing, I, like me personally, like, I, I don't think this is $12,000, but you're saying this is, this is helpful to you. You like this? Yeah. Cause you like driving. Yes. That's correct. Yeah. So if someone so, else were doing it for you, you'd hate it. Yeah. I am a passenger princess. Mm. So now I can be a passenger princess in the driver's seat. Right. What? You already did that. Well. <clears throat> Clap off. They don't make infomercials like You do not know the hour when the Lord is coming. Stay awake. Be happy. What is that? Uh, it's a cult song. Do they teach that in Catholic school? Well, they removed me in fourth grade, so. They said, this one is a sinner. Ooh, this is a game. I hate left turns. Yeah. Now, they call that the Chucky Cook left. What? I don't know. There's this guy named Chuck Cook, and he's just obsessed with that left turn. And what he is just, this man doing? He's dieseling up. Okay, I guess that wasn't as aggressive as I thought it yeah, was. Yeah, no, that was pretty I was normal. just worried that the car wouldn't know what to do. We didn't have to do anything. <clears throat> I talked to this guy. His name was Chuck Cook. Um, yeah, as someone who hates making left turns, Yeah. I like this. I don't know that I'm going to trust it, though. Like, that's what we need is, like, a super busy street. Yeah. Test. Like, that's not that busy. Well, this is also, this is your first time doing this. As you become more comfortable with the software and see the decisions that it makes, you'll be like, oh, I've done this 20 times before. Yeah. And just sit back and let it make danger. Now, will it turn into the middle lane and merge, or does it just wait? Yes, it will turn into that, like, the yellow lines. Yeah. Yeah, it did Which that for me when I was with it. because that's illegal. <laughs> it is illegal. That's how I got a ticket. You got a ticket. I got in a crash, and they're oh. like, yeah, it's your fault. What? 9-11 GT3. Oh, and that's in, I think it's called Volcano Orange or something. That's gorgeous. But the haters will say, doesn't have full self-driving. I don't think anyone will say that. <laughs> You'd be surprised. Well, most Some cars people. don't have, unless you're buying a Waymo. Right. But they'll just... Does any other car have full self-driving? They have... Not really. I think Mercedes has a level four autonomy, but I don't think that's sold in the U.S. Yeah, I mean, I, I I also think, to anyone from Tesla listening, it's really cool that Mercedes, when it's the car is being driven by the computer, that those there's like these green lights on the outside that are oh. lit at all four corners. So it's cool to notify people that have that know that the car is driving itself. So I think that's pretty cool. All right, we could have used a blinker there, Tessie. I guess you technically didn't need it because it was a... Right, but could have used one, you know? I mean, this F-350 might drive right over top of us. Yeah, he's pissed. <laughs> F-350, tank never empty. Damn, everybody in the bank acts friendly. You know who said that? No. Little Wayne. Del Sol. What can Brown do for you? FedEx. Oh, he's going left. Oh. Oh, God. 1-800-HOWS-MY-DRIVING. <laughs> yeah, see, I think I need to feel it more on not the freeway. Yeah. You know? Yeah. You need to do those city streets. That would be interesting to take it, like, into the city. Mm. And Phoenix is a bad... Yeah. Example of that, but like, but it's confusing down there. 
There's one way, two ways, it is three confusing, ways, but train I'm tracks. Like downtown Pittsburgh is. Oh yeah, downtown a Pittsburgh rat. is. How does it? True nightmare. Yeah. And and a lot of people have said, does it? You know, what about pothole avoidance? And it's like, yeah, these are things that if you hit a massive pothole and it, it bends your wheel, pothole. Sorry, yeah. pothole. Ha <laughs> ha. If you hit a pothole. <laughs> And it, and it bends your wheel. That's on you. That's not on Tesla, but will they have the f technology to sense that and avoid it? Maybe. I don't know. It did slow down for like little speed bumps. What? It has her left blinker on. She's confused. Yeah, she's confused. So you I know? thought she was coming at me and I got scared. Yeah. So the pot ha. Yeah, I've spoken about that. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anything else you'd like to report? How's life? We have two children now. You got work coming up. You're not excited yeah. to go back, yeah. but if you guys could buy more Tesla accessories, I'd like to quit my job. <laughs> right. <laughs> Charge cables, sunshade. Yeah. Summer's coming, folks. Yeah. Babies are being had. Hit those Amazon links. <laughs> yeah, hit the links. <laughs> to give you guys an example, so last year I sold $172,000 worth of things on Amazon from the links in my descriptions. And to me, that was about $7,000 in my pocket. So five to $600 a month from, from Amazon. So it's to me on YouTube, if you're not monetized and you're looking for ways to make your YouTube channel profitable or just get like a little kickback for your effort, Amazon is definitely a way to do that. But I only recommend sh uh, showing products on Amazon that you currently use or actually use. Don't just do it because you can earn some money because if you naturally use it and are excited about it, that will come through and increase the sales for you. But uh, So thank you for using those links. That's just a little insight of how that could help you on your channel. Exit lane, security, or not security, construction zone. <laughs> security. Sorry, they my neural security. network is misfiring. They put security on exit lanes now. We actually got sleep last night, so I don't know. We what did get sleep last on. night. Yeah, I just misfire sometimes. But I, yeah, we got sleep last night. Only woke up once for the baby, and then she slept till seven. When uh, we when we wake the up, the toddler slept till seven thirty. That was what was. That scary. was remarkable because normally at five a.m. we wake up with demand demands. Demands. <laughs> Milk. <laughs> Milk. Mook. Okay. All right. I'll get the milk. Shoo me. She stands in the pantry, points to the top shelf she can't reach, and goes, Shoo me. Shoo me, which is smoothie. Yeah. Until we satisfy those demands, we are at her mercy. We are. But then she's I happily so, do it because she so breaks cute. my soul. So we love her. All right. I, I see nothing. I don't think we have we have anything further here. Yeah, no, I think we're good. Uh, maybe we go get some coffee. You want to get some coffee? I'd like to get some coffee. I talked to this lady last week. I said, Barbara, if we don't get coffee soon, I'm going to tell you what your husband's been doing. She's terrible. Can you, like, end this? Well, yeah, I guess that's You just hit end. You just hit end. Okay. Autopilot disengaged. I, what happened? I put my phone but that's cool. You can, you can send a message right there to Elon Musk. Oh. And Elon will... So, Elon, it's respond. Jeff Bezos. Yeah. Okay, so that's kind of nice. Like, e super easy to disengage. How else can you disengage autopilot? Just tap uh, up? Take, the, take control of the wheel. Right, right. Uh, yes. Break, tap up. A little tap up. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> can you... I'm sure you can. Just start it, like, mid-drive. I think you can. Yep. It, it's But it, what's interesting, though, is... If you don't have a... I don't have a thing in. So right. It's so it's just going to take us... It's going to probably take us straight back to the factory in Austin. Okay. So. Right. A little bubble there. Um, do you want coffee? Sure. Oh, wow. It's just going for it. Oh, my God. <laughs> Accelerate around the turn. There. I know. That's what you used to do. It is. When I met Jamie <laughs> in college, I like got in the car with her. First of all, your car in a pig pen, same thing. Whoa, was it that bad? Just, yeah. I didn't even like, it wasn't even like to try to impress you. I one day had to just take her car. Like, I'm not doing this to, like for any other reason than your car needs cleaned. What was and I vacuumed it? it out. There were like six layers of uh, Chex Mix and no. goldfish. And there was, under your seat, there was a, a family of beavers down there. They made a <laughs> dam of all the stuff. Yeah, it was unbelievable. All right, leave me alone. 
but anyways, when she drove me, I was also, I was just like, she, exce- we were going like through an not- interview, you just like, she accelerated through an intersection. I was a really bad driver. Yeah, but then you got it together. I gave I you the talk. I don't know. I don't think it was that. I think I just one day decided I'm going to not be a bad driver. Yeah, because you're a capable person. Right. Yeah. Right. And except for that curb that jumped out at you and you 360'd the wheel. So if you guys need wheel protectors, I unfortunately had to put them on my car because Jamie 360'd one. Get them from Vion.com. It's a single snap. There's padding on the back to protect your wheel from any scratching. And if you do scratch it, this wheel protector won't let it actually scratch the paint and you can't even tell they're there. I highly recommend it. Free shipping, 10% off, code Jeebs. I mean, it'll be linked in the description. It's from Vion. I've worked with them for three years. They're excellent, well-priced, all that stuff. So go there to get that. Okay. All right, so now we're going through a four-way intersection. Infant in the back. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I mean... I don't trust it that much. Nope, nope. Oh, we got the red light. Okay. And it stays in the, the appropriate lane when it makes the left. Kind of. Kind of, but better right? than most people. See, that's the nice part about this is I can look out the window. Yeah. And, and have a little bit. My surroundings. And, and like, look, everyone is supposed to have their hands on the wheel and pay attention at oh. all times, right? But I'm, I'm just saying in general. But having this... Like, let's say your infant is crying or screaming in the back. You have to turn around and hand them something. At least you have something, even with just autopilot, yeah. that is controlling and monitoring what's going on. While that split second you turn and look back, if something happens, you have that support there. I think that's good, and every Tesla comes with autopilot. I also think it's very smart that they give everyone this feature. The acceleration is really natural. Slightly aggressive, it's perfect in my opinion. Oh, so maybe we should switch this to assertive mode and see what the heck it does. Yeah, assertive, it's just if there's a car slow in front of you, it's gonna it, go around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it really is. Um... We, I did had that happen the first time. Oh, I and this is kind of cool here full screen visualization. Oh, yeah, yeah, I don't really like that. Um... Okay, oh, there we go, there we go. you don't like that. You just... No, I like to see the map. Okay, yeah, what are you gonna get from Starbucks? I don't know. I don't. I already had a coffee, so maybe I'll get something a little fruity. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that was a little aggressive. Um, it led us to one that's in a safe way. No. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not doing that. Oh, that's terrible. It really is a tragedy. It really that is. should be marked. When you go to a Starbucks, I want to go to the real thing. I want to see the barista. Okay, so it did take us in the weird entrance. Yeah. Okay, now it's just delivering us. Yeah, delivered to the front. All right. Well, should we just go home? Yeah. Well, folks, there you have it. Now, if you want to see me do a road trip with this passenger princess, you can click this video right here. And I never talked about the car seat, but it'll be linked in the description.